talk? Okay, I'm talking now, testing the audio. Oh, dude, this battery's on two bars, too. I thought I, I... I may have not charged any of my batteries. It'll just be a short... It's solar-powered. So what's funny is, like, now the camera's in the shade and we're in the sun. Yeah. But it's good, because I needed to get Wait, you... Wait, what's solar-powered? The camera? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> kidding, I'm kidding. Wait, on this week's episode of the Nikon Rozzy Podcast, yeah. I interview Matt... You gotta, you gotta advertise, you know. Wherever you go, you gotta represent. Are you still filming? No, it's filming right now. I just re, I restarted. Yeah, but you just ruined your advertiser. Why? Hello, gentlemen. I think you gotta be louder because the mic's really far I away. I wasn't trying to. I wasn't trying to. You be weren't. For that. But yes, this is like the podcast with Oscar. My, my hair's just in my face. Tony, you should have put it up in a. You know what? You I, have an, I it, have an put idea. Put in a nice braid. I have an idea. Just, I don't know. Keep talking to people. I, I got an idea. Alright, I'm just gonna. What are you gonna some, do? Some water put on. the water in it. Yeah, I just gotta know. Just trust no, me, bro. that's gonna look horrible. No, dude, you just gotta. So it can slick back. There we go. Done, dude. Now it looks like you're sweaty. Now we're done. You look very sweaty. You look suave, dude. My pink shirt. So, yeah, my... oh. did I tell you the time my mom oh, thought. Primo. Th <laughs> <laughs> did I tell you the time my mom thought? Um, that my white shirt got pink because I, I washed it bad. No. Yeah. You didn't tell me that. I didn't tell you that in the car ride? Oh, cool. So I can tell you on my podcast. Exactly. So. I've never heard this story before. <laughs> there was a butterfly. Oh, before... Oh, that really hurt. Before we continue, is there a list of things that, like, I can't talk to you about that you wouldn't want to be on the podcast? Um. Like, politics, is that a no-go? Um... Uh, I'm kidding. I mean, I don't know. If it comes up, anything comes up, yeah, I'll just tell you to shut the hell up. Sounds good, boss. Um, what was your first job? Was it my first job? Was you were there for like two years? I was there for four years, actually. Oh wow! Yep, it was an absolute. Uh, well, actually, since this is on YouTube, it was an absolute, absolute delight. It was wonderful. No complaints. No, we'll I do don't... right now. <laughs> I'm going to zoom it in, and we can do, like, this thing where we pretend like we're laughing, and I'll play, like, the Friends theme song or something. It'll, like, zoom in, and then it'll be, like, us being like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Will you touch my hand lightly? Yeah, yeah, like yeah, that? yeah, and then we'll just be laughing together. Like, okay. it was an absolute, like, uh, I'm, I'm going to re-ask you the question. So, Matt, how, <laughs> so, Matt, how is it, so, so, Matt, how is it, <laughs> Matt, how is your experience, like? Well, Nikon, if I have to be honest with you, yeah. it was an absolute delight. <laughs> It'll make sense when I, like... When you do it? Yeah, I actually stole that from, um... I'm so not original. I stole that from 
Burt Kreischer has this thing called. Burt Kreischer. Uh, Burt Kreischer's "I'm the Machine," who took his shirt off that one comedian. I have no idea who that is. Wow. Sorry. No, I'll show it I'm to you. I'm telling you, I only listen to Chris D'Elia. Only Chris D'Elia. Chris D'Elia. Only Chris D'Elia. Exclusively Chris D'Elia. Jeez, man. I'm telling you, he's the he's funniest pretty, man he's on the face of the. He's pretty legit. Yeah. He makes fun of people in the airport Him, a lot. Yeah, I know. Him, and then Tim and Eric, and then Eric Andre. If you actually Top don't four. like move your hands, the flies like don't come like to you right now. There's no flies. So on. I just have to pretend like I'm. Dead. Yeah, it's don't. Yeah, actually, they, okay. they don't like movement. Um, right, I can do that. What was I telling you about? What was I? Why are yeah, my glasses have, off? I, I can't adjust. see. That's I'm why I adjust, felt weird. And now the flies are gonna attack again. No, because you uh, just move. Oh, I can see again. I forgot what it was like with my glasses on. I'm already sweating. Are you you're directly under the side? Yeah, I know. Everything's fine. Oh, you're gonna get burned. Everything's fine. I felt it's bad fine. too. We came here and I was like, we gotta go in the shade. Everything is fine. But you will match your shirt. I will match. My and maybe shirt. I'll get pink. Hey, it's fine. I'll match my shirt. Everything's fine. So, anyways, yeah, my mom's all like, uh, just st- oh, savage. Like, did the... you wash your shirt with like red clothes? And I'm like, no, I bought this shirt like. Last week, are you sure? I think it was white. I'm like, no, mom. I'm pretty sure I knew what my shirt looked like before when I bought it. Terrible. You said that. Yeah, my my mom is interesting because. Um, does she not like the color pink? No, no, she does. <laughs> but like, she she's not super like she's affectionate, but she's not like crazy affectionate. And then like on my Instagram now, which I love, she'll be like. Like someone she was posts, asking, like, like and stuff? yeah, she puts hearts and stuff and gets very like that's a nice moment. comments to other people on my comments. <laughs> she sounds like a saint. Oh, she does. Tell me about your mom, Matt. Uh, my mom's a nice lady. She's yeah. very nice. She's pretty affectionate, actually. She is. My, yeah. mine's really she doesn't have an Instagram or anything. You're lucky. Maybe dude. she does. I don't know. Yeah, my mom's friends found me on Instagram, Facebook. My oh, even your mom's friends. Have, oh, that sounds like a yeah. I, it's kind of yeah. So I can't do any of my crazy posts now. Keep what it. kind of crazy post are you talking about? Now? It's like if I wanted to go out to like McDonald's at like two a.m. Oh, yeah, or something, just shove can't. food in my can't. Can't have that because I'll look in. I'll look. Yeah, can't, can't gotta represent that. my mom. Yeah, especially not if you're wearing that pink shirt out. Yeah, she I'm, doesn't want to see that. So I'm trying to be healthy right now. I, I've been doing my my videos. I don't know if you've seen any of my uh, daily running videos. Have you daily? Uh, yes, yeah, on little, Instagram. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I've seen those. And I've been trying to eat healthier, but. Today, I just want to go to Taco Bell. Like, I cannot stop You it. know, I'll be honest with you. Don't think I'll be able to eat Taco Bell. Last time I ate Taco Bell, why didn't really uh, agree with me at all. Really? Everyone says that, but I never have it happen to me. Like, everything you know my I mom eat, called Taco Bell what? growing up? What? Taco Smell. Taco Smell? Yeah. That's what she called it. Really? I had stuff I was going to ask you. Lay it on me. So for those that don't know, how did you become, or almost become a manager at Lure? How did that work out? How did that, like, did they, t- how did they ask you? Like, how did it come know, they about? Ju- they just asked me, and I said, sure. Like, I'll hey, be, do you want to have some managing do wanna, shift? Do you want an essay? And I said, yes. Wait, essay is what they say? Yeah, like services says that? Essay. Oh, I was like, why do you keep saying essay? When I was, like, asking you, no, I'm not saying, like, like, Savannah's I'm not an saying, essay. like, what's up, essay? Yeah, you're, I'm like, Savannah's like an essay. And I'm no, like, what's Savannah's an essay? No. I'm not saying it like what's Savannah and Riley wanted me to talk about them on my podcast. Did they? Yeah. What they want you to say about them? They were like, "Do you ever talk about us in your podcast?" Well, now you talked about them. Now so I talked about. Promise fulfilled. I worked a double for Riley yesterday. Just for Riley, not even for Lord, just for Riley. I thought you went home. I saw you leave. <laughs> no, I, I I took a photo on my Instagram. I put it was like ten hours, and twenty six uh, minutes, and two hours. Said. No, because I, I did take an hour break, and I was eating in the back. Oh, that's, that's when I was saying oh, Friday. Okay. Yeah, I thought you were just leaving. I stayed there till 8.30. I got in at 9.30. And making those hours, making I'm that working money. working for the, my first five days a week, too. First five days a week? Yeah. I've been on, I'm on, yeah, I'm on five days a week now. And five days a week? I think I was before, too. I don't remember. That's probably why, but I, okay, this is what I want to talk about. Like how I said that? Uh, okay. You have notes now? I didn't say, no, 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 no. I'm just going to put an alarm just so I know how long, cause it's one right now. I just want to. Oh, yeah, because you have to work two. at four. Yeah, I just want to make sure I make it back in yeah. time for that. Speaking of work. But, uh, yeah, Who you are you working just... with tonight? Uh, Tori, actually. It's a host girl. She's not on my Instagram. Okay. Yeah, she won't see this. 
All right, cool. Because I have no idea who that is. She just started working. She's like shorter. Oh, she and has just started working. Blonde hair. Oh no no no! I know. Never yeah, mind. yeah, I know who for she is. sure. You know she her. was there yesterday. No, no, yesterday, there. the day before. Yeah. Yeah. No, no. She seems very nice. Yeah, she's really helpful. Yeah. We've all got helpful people there. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, there's a lot of girls there. You still have boyfriends. What are you gonna do, eh? I don't know. What are you gonna do? There was just one girl at at uh, at the gym that I saw though. Yeah. And, and she worked there, and I I think we had a moment because walk me through this moment. So what happened? I went in the gym, and it was right out of work, and I really didn't want to go, but I was like, I have to post it on Instagram, holding myself accountable. Accountability is everything, and I need to put it you're on looking, there. Uh, you're looking pretty big. I've always been big. I'm trying to like just lean out. Honestly, dude, this shirt. I think I think my shirts are just shrinking. Pretty generous. Yeah, no, I think they're just shrinking. I've always been How much like. You bench it now. I, I don't bench that much. That's the thing. I'm not. I can't even lift that much weight. Maybe ninety pounds on the bench. Huh. Or That's at, like... at most. No, sorry, not ninety pounds. No, because I. Okay, so. Oh, nine hundred pounds. Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant okay. to say. Nine hundred gotcha. pounds. No, like okay. probably uh, I put like a little bench. The bench pull is like forty the bar is pounds 45, apparently. Yeah. And then you, I put like two twenty fives, and that's me pushing yeah, that's 95. it. That's like max. That's that's max, but I don't even bench actually. Yeah, that's what I. That's like when I was going to the gym. Yeah. Like almost on the reg regular. I I think I got up to like one ten, one fifteen. Yeah, I've never I never go heavy though, uh, and I'm actually. I was always able to do the 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 dumbbell press more than the than the bench. So I'm not good on the dumbbell press, but I'm using that more instead of doing the bench because I think I get better range of motion and I don't really want to mess that, up my that, my shoulders. Um, I've heard, I don't know if this is what? true, I'm not a it, no, tell fitness me. guru or anything, tell me, tell but me. I've heard that the dumbbell press actually uh, builds more strength than the bench. That's what I've heard too, that's why. I think why the bench I... is just about like um, the... forming like the muscle and like the look, but I think that the dumbbell press actually You can strength. control how you move the weight, exactly. you can bring your hands wider to enter more and work more of your chest, whereas the bench you're stuck to one position, and I always feel more in, in my shoulders, which I don't want to On feel the bench? On the bench, yeah. if I'm using my, my chest. But anyways, back to, so I go into the gym. Yeah. And, I mean, I didn't know how old she was because she looked like she might be, I thought at first she was like maybe, early, like up 26, 24, like no way, no way comprende. Um, that means I don't understand. <laughs> really? In Spanish, yeah. I spoke Spanish. El tegua, el fuego, el muscado, el, el, el piso mate ferrel. You said fuego, which means fire. You're on fire. That's not. I don't think you even knew what you were saying. I didn't know fuego was fire. I, th fuego I thought that was, was gibberish. I honestly thought that was gibberish. No, nope, fuego's fire. I took I, four years of Spanish. Did you really? I know about speak, five Spanish speak words. Spanish. I can't. I know about five. Spanish How do you words. not? Would you just say? Yeah, no comprende means I don't understand. Say it with the Spanish tone. No comprende. That's not. No comida. What? You're just making everything sound have a silent H. <laughs> El huevo. El huevos noches. No terenes. Anyways. Eggs night. What? I'm <laughs> impressed I even said Spanish. I thought it just sounded Spanish. But anyway, she's really pretty yeah. and like. So you talked to her, right? No, no, I just looked at her. But we both looked at each other in the eyes, dude. In the eyes. And. And, and I was like, hi, how's it going? And she's like... You just said you didn't talk to her. What's hi. happening? Oh, I didn't talk to her. <laughs> I, well, not at that moment, okay? Oh. There's nobody else there. And I was like, hi, how's it going? And she said, hi, how's it going? And uh, that was that was big for me, dude. She said, she, she acknowledged my, you know, it was weird. Felt the connection there. And then... And then you showed her the gun show. No, I just went out. I hate to get a pump first because you don't want to, you want to start... But then you showed her the gun show. I did arms that day. Shh, boom. Shorter and she was walking show. by, cleaning the bags and stuff, and I was doing, like, a tricep Ooh. press, and I had a really tight shirt on. You could see yeah. my belly button. I was yeah. just like... You're like, hey. Hey. But I was just you checking my... pop open this six-pack later? And by six-pack, yeah. I mean this? I mean this one pack? That's what you said? No, I didn't oh. say that. But we, she looked at me when I was, like, lifting. When I went to get water and I was walking Wait, by her... She looked, yeah, she works there, and she looked at me. And when I was walking by her, she also looked at me. So, it's, uh, so it's nice. pretty, it's pretty, to, to for sure happening. 
Uh, but, but when I was leaving too, I did wanted. Did you say I, goodbye to her? Yeah, I did. So this is really funny. I went to her and I said like, "Have a great night." And she actually, she was like writing something. She looked up at me and she like, I could. This is why I say I think there was something because she there like she talked to me and then also, she kept talking to me. It wasn't like you're regular. Like, oh hi, bye, good night. Like like trying to get you out of there. Almost yeah. Like she was still continuing the conversation. And it was at that point where I started thinking maybe she's nineteen, eighteen, or twenty, maybe. You she, never know. It's you hard to tell. I, sh- I might ask her, but I didn't get her phone number or anything. I wanted to start. Yeah, but slow. you'll be going to that gym more. Promise. She only works at night, so I just gotta go late at night. So now. now you just only work out at night. I have to work out at night all the time. Ruins my rest. Only on her shifts. I don't. I don't know her shift. That's a little weird. I think. You gotta I sneak in there. But find I. Her I talked to her and I and, I, and I was like, "How long are you gonna stay in here for?" And she's like, "Till eleven thirty. And I'm like, oh, yeah. And I don't know why I said this, but I was like, I worked the double today. <laughs> I worked for 12 hours to say, like, to say, like, you know, I've worked a lot, too. And she's like, oh, yeah? And I'm like, yeah. She's Did like, you tell you work at Lure? She's like, yeah. She's like, where do you work at? I'm like, Lure. And this is the part where she was, like, getting impressed. And then I ended it right then and there. She's like, oh, you work at Lure? Lure's impressive. Are you? It is impressive. Are you a server at Lure? And then you just go, Yes. I should have, but I didn't. I I, I want to be super honest. And you I, go, no, I'm not a server. I own the place. <laughs> I didn't want her to. I wanted to also see like if she'd still be into me. You know, I don't want people to be into me just because they think I'm a server. But, yeah, but I don't know if she if then if I you said, said you're a host. Yeah, and she's I, not into you still. That's like I ruined it because I was like I'm a I'm a host there. I, I almost said I've been there for two years though, but I'm a host, and I was like I yeah, didn't but say that. If she's that. not into you for that, that's like her. Issue. That's true. That's why I thought. Like, what exactly. is she doing there at, at the gym? She's yeah. basically a host. Yeah, exactly. I'm what you are. The hell? No, no, but, but she, she she didn't make a face or anything. I just felt weird because it was like I could have gone with the server thing, and I just said, no, I'm a host. Yeah, but you know what? It's probably better that you said, yes, I'm a host. Because she, she lives. She might see me, yeah, and then, know, but I could have just said, but I could have just said easily, like, I do both. Um, And then she, you know, says the one thing everyone says, I love you guys, is ahi ceviche. Everyone says that? Every girl, I think, pretty much says, oh, yeah, you guys have great ahi ceviche. Is that why you said that you would take me there and get ahi ceviche? Only on happy hour, too. One. One ceviche, because it's cheaper. It's cheaper, was... actually, if you go in not on happy hour and then get the the it off, like your meal. Oh, oh, yeah, If I, but if you don't work there and you're just going in there, that's what I meant. Oh, I was yeah. just trying to sound cheap on the phone, like, I'll take you to lure, but only for the happy hour time and um, only get ahi ceviche. Right over my head. I was. That's what I was trying to go for. It's okay. Right over my head. Not everyone's as comically advanced as I am. Not. Comedically advanced. Um. So yeah, and then that was it. That was the. Yeah. Well, you just gotta keep going. In. Yeah, that's it. Just keep pumping that iron, you know. Yeah, just pumping it, dude. To be able to like grab the weights and go over to her while she's at the front desk with all the other gym workers, and I'll just. Hey, how's it going? Be like, hey, I think something's wrong. My arm's pretty swollen right now. Oh, <laughs> that's perfect. That's perfect. Oh, right. no, wait. That's just me. <laughs> oh, my God, dude. That's the worst thing to say. That's so douchey. You know what I really wanted to do, though? There's signs at my gym that say, no loud grunting. And I really want to just... Thank God. I really just want to get... That is the worst. I when really just want to get... Why do they do that? I just really well. It's necessary to build muscle. It's no- <laughs> I wanted to grab five pound weights and Matt, have someone. You don't understand. It's Matt, necessary. you just you're not. You just don't I, understand. That was my biggest pet peeve. Really? Like just grown <laughs> men in there, just like. Ugh, <laughs> ugh. Why are you doing that? Hey, dude. <laughs> there was an old guy. Hey man, just lift the weights. There was an old and guy. Don't make any noise. There was an old guy in my gym last night, and in, in my gym, in my gym, he wore like this black drench coat thing, and he's grabbing dumbbells like to work out his back and he this is he's grabbing like 45 this is he's not even exten- he's just doing like this just jerking his hand up and down he's just practicing he's like, to start his lawnmower dude Ugh. he can't start his lawnmower anymore and then he just so gets he's like, up gotta build, he's he gets gotta up. build that muscle to he, start that lawnmower he puts his hand on he's like oh and I'm like Do what the f- was that when I went to 24 yeah my buddy Zach and I used to go all the time and there used to be this dude I don't know how old he was he was pretty old, actually. He's probably like 55, maybe 60, the oldest. Yeah. Come in, he'd always have this bright orange shirt on, mm. shorts, and they weren't even like gym shorts. They were just like khaki shorts. 
come in, go directly to the pull-up bar, and I'm not making this up, would start flipping. He'd like be on it and just start swinging back and forth where he's almost parallel, like 90 degrees with the bar. And my buddy and I would just stare at him and be like, what is that? Like, we're just like, maybe, you know, maybe he's a psycho, has no idea what he's doing, but maybe he's onto something and he's a genius. Wait, was he lifting himself at 90? No. He was just like a swing. Like, imagine he's the swing and he's just going like this. <laughs> so just, he's, he's just he's holding I'm, on the bar. And 15 minutes straight of just doing like his like, hands must be calloused out. Here's the bar. He's like this. How is this like, is it a flat bar? Yep. How is he not burning his I hands? I don't know. <laughs> Dude was a maniac. <laughs> Would he make any sounds? No. Would he be like, ah? No. He was, ah! A, he was a madman. You know what I really want to do that? I want to go to the gym right with a no grunting sign, and I want someone to film me, and I'm going to make sounds like, ready? I'm going to go into character. Okay. That would be... Just like that. Yeah, but then she'd have to kick you out. Maybe she'd like be like, and one hundred percent. I didn't do that. That would never happen, ever. You don't know, dude. Anything can happen, dude. I don't think we're loud enough. I think we are. By the way, if we're not loud enough, if you're a supporter, just know I support you one hundred percent. If you're a supporter. I won't say it. <laughs> I thought you were. That's why I said it. Oh. I just thought you were. No. I was going to say, if you're. Go. That's what I would like to say. Don't worry. I'll do all this out. Like. Should I leave. That's what I would say. Should, should I leave the part and then just put the part? So if you're. And then go. Or would you prefer to save your. Or maybe not. But would you prefer me just to. Right when you say. I put the quack sound. And you don't hear anything. You just hear a few quack, 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 like just like that. Yeah, do that. Let's do that because... Leave it up to interpretation. Yeah, well, that's, that's better because there's a lot of people that are that. Yeah. And especially sadly. Oh, yeah. I got some stories, honestly, man. Did. There's... We had that one, dude. Who are... The... Yeah. You guys actually... I mean, I didn't... I wasn't that saying. Wait, time. wait. I, know you... we... I, I know sat we... him. We told him... To... I... He was like being, he was being what would he do? ridiculous. What would he do? I think he was just like, I think he was just being super loud and just, just basically like just disrespectful to everyone. Really? Because I was quiet. He asked me. Yeah, but then he, you know, he had a, it's like, uh, you know, I don't know. I don't know, dude. He sat my hand. That's my, uh. No, no man, it's, it's crazy, but you know what? I'm not going to quack. We're just not. I'm uh, not going to quack this part out, though. I find it interesting with politics, uh, how, I don't know what I was going to say. I don't really, I just want you to have a good argument for whoever you support. I just want you to have I agree with some that. kind of a knowledge or some kind of, if it's a solid foundation based off of some yeah. kind of fact, even 10 that. minutes of just Googling the candidate. I agree with looking that. Looking at, yeah. 100% agree. And not getting in with your emotions or, and it's tough And also just be open up to other, what other people have to say. Yeah, uh, other beliefs you know? too. But I, I feel like things are going to work out. I don't think, I think everything's just working out. I think we're just going to, I think it's just madness so. and chaotic right now. But I Let's feel like so. in a couple more years, everything is just, yeah, I don't know. I'll have to, I don't know how I'm going to duck everything of that out, but I will. I don't know. Um, I don't know. I think people should talk more about politics, and I think people should stop being so about other people's opinions. I think that's a real issue. I think that because of the reason, I think... And people should say please and thank you more often. Well, that for sure. But I think people should just be more open to discussions and still respect each other. If yeah. you're Republican, if you're Democrat, if you're this, We're if you like Hillary, if you like Bernie, if you like Trump, if you like Bush, whatever. Respect each other. Have conversations about why you have those beliefs. And then go out... I have a lot of friends that are... Totally different opinions of me. They have Confederate flags or whatever. Oh my God. But it's more because of their tradition, though. Like, gotcha. they were raised with it. So, raised for them, that. yeah, that's another thing. But I'm not going to hate on someone 
or not talk to them or treat them some certain way. And they don't even they're not even mean to me and I'm Middle Eastern, so that's really interesting. And you know, it just that's I, good. I just think we all need more tolerance, but I think it's important to talk about it, because when you don't talk about it, when you hold that all in, then something crazy happens, then you get the characters like then you get the problems that we get in face. When no one talks about how they really feel, what they really want, they get pushed, they get oppressed, and then they just go They go for the extreme. They go for the extreme, and that's a lot of Unfort I know a lot Are of people extreme. said, well, because well, they're just sick of, uh, or they said we're sick of what's happening. We're sick of Washington. We're gonna go to the extreme, which yeah. I can totally understand. Yeah, I can totally yeah, no, understand. I, no, no, I feel that. I, I feel can that. see why you would go a certain route. Do you ever watch uh, John Oliver? Uh, I've heard of him on HBO. I've heard of him. I, uh, oh, oh with God. yes, yes, yeah. I watch. Honestly, I watch more of a the I Late always... Night Show. But John Oliver, I love him too. What's the Late Night Show? The Late Night Show with uh, Stephen Colbert. Yeah. Oh yeah, I love from Colbert Report. Yeah. People are getting mad at him because he's going so hard. Yeah, on... he's going pretty hard. So is John Oliver though. Thank... John Oliver goes pretty hard. But I mean, if I mean, look, if you're for an entertainment, what gets more? I mean, he just does so much stuff all the time. Exactly. Like, but people are getting sick of it. And then this is another problem we have, is that, okay, if someone does something, but they do it like so much crazy stuff, do you always report it? You should. But then everyone. You should. But then the argument is. Oh, you just keep doing that so we don't look at the real... There's, like, so much stuff going around. Like well, it's he's so the news every day now. Which kind of... I you mean, can't I, turn the news on with the news. I, I think a lot of people are sick of it. But, I mean, what do you, you can't I'm not... You can't not have it. No, because you, you have to cover it. You have to be informed. You can't yeah. say something that exactly. doesn't go along with your beliefs. But exactly. Again, I don't want to get into political stuff too much. I just want to emphasize, tolerate other people. You know, tolerance is really important. And understand how to... See from other people's perspectives and not just your own. I think by doing that, we'll avoid a lot more hate. Yeah. So I'm even trying to not go super hard on what I would rather say because I just don't want to make anyone else who watches this feel like I'm pushing them out. Like I've seen a lot of podcasts where I actually got a little Push upset out because of what they're pushing their beliefs so much. Yeah, it's tough, and I think yeah. I think as someone yeah, you got to like, balance it. I have to balance it. I have to balance it, and, and, and just so yeah, but I don't know. But also at the same time, like. You, that's the dilemma you know? I have. That's the dilemma I have because you can. You say, should be able to like say what you want. No, you should say what you want, but you but, shouldn't. You should. But you shouldn't be. Yeah. You know, aggressive about it. And, and you shouldn't like, be hundred percent and shutting people down. Right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you can't be hundred percent and say you're wrong. Exactly. Or have that feeling. You have to come from somewhere of no. Okay. So you worked at for four years. Do you have any crazy doing story? A crazy one eighty. Yeah. <laughs> no. Just that's how podcasts are. Just the, just the whoa. Just the, Dude, crazy stories. Yeah, I got a ton. Yeah, tell me some, cause cause I've been there a couple um, times and I've seen some drunk let's see, teachers. You wanna go? T -t 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 teachers, drunk t -t 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 teachers come up to me and start talking to me. Do you want to go? Let's see. We can go mild first or extreme first. Let's go mild first. Mild first. Let's, All right. Let's ease our way. Let me think about some mild ones first. Through my stomach. Cause it's been a while since I worked there now. Yeah. It's been a long time. I can imagine because everyone knows okay. of or alcohol, I feel like. Yes. I also don't want to, like, I don't know. Well, don't say any names or to, talk like, bad, bad about managing. No, yeah, no, I don't no. want to bad mouth. It's a wonderful place. Yeah. Great beer. Great food. Okay. It's fun. But, like all restaurants, get some crazies in there. This is nothing against <laughs> personally. Okay. But... Okay. Shout out to Lure Fish House, by the way, in Camarillo, ro located at uh, 147 Airport Way. Yeah, I can continue. Is that actually the address? No, I, it's something Airport Way. I don't remember. No, I don't think it's Airport Way. I was just trying to sponsor for Lure. I think Airport Way is Waypoint Cafe. Oh, yeah. It's also a good restaurant. Shout also, out to Waypoint yeah. Cafe. Okay, sorry. But not going. really. Go to Lure instead. Yeah, Lure's, you can't beat Lure. Uh, and we're not just saying that because we work there. No, it really is good. Okay, sorry, keep I'm going. I'm not affiliated. He's not affiliated. He doesn't work there. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't. He doesn't. He doesn't. An essay there. Essay. Um. So sorry. Okay. So sorry. I think this was like within the first, probably month or two of me working there. Um, I started out as a host, and I was up at the front. It was probably like late at night, maybe around like eleven o'clock. Yeah. And I hear like a commotion behind me, like some yelling. And next thing I know, some dudes like walking up there. He's like heated, heated as hell, and he's like yelling behind him like. Is this how you run this place? But like saying all this like crazy stuff. Yeah. And um, a manager comes up behind him, and that's who he's yelling out. And the guy's like, "I'm gonna call corporate over this." Like saying all this crazy stuff. I don't even know what happened, 
but he's like saying all this crazy stuff, like cursing. And my mentor's just like, like you need, like you need to leave, like you yeah. need to get out. And the guy's like, yeah, well, I'm gonna call like your boss or whatever. Mm. And the manager goes, <laughs> this is probably bad for him to do. Manager picks up the business cards that we have on the front desk, yeah. throws them at the guy, says, fine, call him then. Throws them the the the. The business no. cards go everywhere. No. And I'm just out there. This is... Oh, my God. Did a fly go in your mouth? Yeah. I oh said a fly go in my mouth. I'm so sorry. That looked disgusting. Oh, my God. It just went in my mouth. Oh, my God. Are you okay? I spit it out. I don't know how it didn't... Do you need oh. the Heimlich? No, I'll keep going. I'm not certified. Right. I'm not certified in the Heimlich, but I can try. A Heimlich? Yeah. Uh, Do you get certified in the Heimlich, or is it only CPR? What's a Heimlich? When you, you know, go behind someone... Oh, you know oh, you, you mean a dry that? hump? I think it's called the Heimlich, but uh, you are younger than me, so yeah. maybe they renamed it. My to four that. years. Maybe they renamed it to that. All right, continue. <laughs> um, yes. Yeah, so he throws the, the cards. He throws at the him? business cards at him. I thought he just played that out. Yeah, really literally just throws the business cards at the guy. I would have done the same though. Dude goes, oh, well now look what you did, caused a huge mess. Have fun cleaning that up. And my manager pushed them out the door and oh. closed it. Not like physically pushed oh, them, yeah, but like, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, it was like yeah, getting yeah, closer. Yeah. It was like, go, 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 you know? And closed the door. And that was uh, within a month of me working there. And that's my first job. And I was very scared. So this is my Little 18 year old Matt. <laughs> nice and skinny, up at the front desk. Very scared. Nice. Very nervous. Um, Let's see. What's the crazy one? Here, I'll give you a. The most extreme one okay. that's ever happened there. Okay. I was actually working when this happened. Um, I hear a lot of commotion going on. I'm serving. This was this was uh, the year I left. Okay. So last year. Oh, wow. 2017. So I didn't leave because of this or anything. Okay. I left because I got a job at Lure, and Lure's the best. Um, Shout out to Lure. There, so I'm serving. It's late at night, probably like 10, 11 again. A lot of commotion going on around the restaurant. Management's kind of on the fritz, kind of freaking out a little bit. So I go up to one of them, like, hey, what's going on? And they're like, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. I'm like, okay. Wait, sorry, Finally, another sorry. server comes up. Oh, yeah, fine. It's nice out though. It is nice out. Huh? It's a nice it's a day. Good day to go to Lord Fish House for happy hour from four to six. Consider our heated enclosed you know, you patio or keep front patio. About it, and I, I'm like getting hungry for it now. So I'll get you a sip. No, no, you know, a I'll fly just, just went straight on your lip. I know, I saw. I that was it. that was bad. I'll probably just end up going to like Sharkies or Snapper Jacks. Oh, so I'm not, still in where's the mood Snapper for, Jacks? I've it's over been. by um by the Roxy. You know where like Sapphire there. is? Like never the been there. Sapphire the American Bistro. I've never stepped foot in that restaurant, but like when you get never off been, I've on, heard so much about Snapper Jacks. When you get off on Oh man. We could make it to Snapper Jacks if we want to go together. Yeah, if we got time. I mean, don't Yeah, because it's not even it. two yet, and I don't think it's really good. I mean yeah, I just don't put worry that for about precaution. it. I mean if you can. Yeah. Snapper Jacks is good. They got some good tacos. They got some good fish tacos there. I might just need a reshower though. It's not a fancy place. Just walk in, order tacos at the counter, and no, sit down. No, for out. Lure. Oh, yeah, for Lure, you have to reshower. Shout out to Lure Definitely. Fish House. Definitely will have to reshower for Lure. Lure. Um, Laura, Lure, yeah, I know. Notch. Stop talking about Laura, dude. I'm not talking Laura about Fish I'm House. Lure. I'm kidding. <laughs> um, Snapper Jack's is Taco Place? Yeah, Snapple Jack, Snapper Jack's Taco Snapple Jack's? Shack is Taco the Jack? full name. But it's like Very corn delicious taco, food. like cornbread. Um, you can either get. That's literally the same plane now going the opposite way. Hey, bro. We're trying to shoot a podcast over here, bro. I think that's a... Uh... I, I, I've clocked this. This area is like mine, dude. You know why he's over here, dude? You flew your freaking drone. No. That's a U.S. Air Force plane. That's not a U.S. Air yes, Force Look plane. at that. No. That's a B-25. Oh, that might be a B-25. I thought it was a personal That's 100% plane. a B-25. They would not send a plane over for one drone. But, no. dude, look Plus at his B-25. maneuvers. Holy cow. B-25 is from World War II, so I don't know. Dude, he's doing a 180. He's, like, turned knife-edged around us. Look at that. 
Hey! See, look, there's the U.S. Air Force sign. See it? Oh yeah. Yeah, I think that's a B-25. That's one of those in there. Oh my God! What? Where'd that come from? He's chasing him. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not sure what's going on right now. North Korea attack. Something's happening. Matt, what that is. this is my last day on Earth. I just want you to know. Wait, where'd that other plane go? I don't know, dude. We're doing a podcast, bruh. Right, okay, so what were you telling about? The, so um, Snapper Jacks is corn. But I don't know, dude. So yeah, you can either get soft tortillas or they have like the crispy ones. I usually prefer the crispy ones. I think they're still corn. They're just crispy. Yeah, yeah. Is it really that good? Yes. It is. Better than so, KFC? Well, I mean, like, Better than Wingstop. You know, I'm going to leave the food situation up to you. You choose. I'll leave whatever, as long as it's not McDonald's, Taco Bell, Carl's Jr., Jack in the Box. Hey, I'm on a diet now, Anything bro. Anything like that. I mean, it, well, Snapper Jack sounds cool, but I, I'm not... No, a... Snapper Jack's legit. You get two tacos, and you get rice and beans. Two I think it's small like eight tacos? Bucks. No, they're big. Fine, bro. You know what? We'll go to Wingstop. We'll get like six dozen wings. And you'll eat five dozen, and I'll eat a dozen. I never did that. I would always go to Wingstop and just get the small little three pieces and the fries and the drink. How do you do the big wing thing? Oh, I, don't, I was just making that up. I have no oh, idea. If that's so I, thought you, like, I always got it. the... Um, I don't really like the wings at Wingstop, really. I prefer the chicken strips. That's I what I get. Sorry, I've never got it. The chicken strips yeah. are better. Because yeah, the like wings are too. small. Like, there's not a lot of meat on them. Sorry, what, what was your what, what was the thing before the oh, airplane we had that the, we were... uh, we had the story. Complete 180. Okay, keep going. Um, now we're doing 360s. 720s uh, next. 720s. 4K next. 1440 <laughs> 1440s. <coughs> there, there you go. Boom, there That's you why go. the manager. SA. Thanks. I'm going to call you hey, SA. Don't do that. I'm going to go to Savannah too. Be like, hey, what's up, SA? When are you going to be a man? I'm kidding. When are you going to be a man? <laughs> Wait, manager, I was going to man, oh god. What's up, Bessie, what are you going to be a man? No, she's not even going to listen to this. Riley and Savannah don't even look They're at already this tuning stuff. in right now. It's live. It's, it's live? Wait, tell me the story, though. What, yeah. Oh, yeah, so anyways, um, yeah. managers are freaking out. I kind of asked them, like, what was going on, and they, you know, just kind of shoo me away. Okay. Another server comes up to me eventually and was like, hey, I think there's, like, some dude passed out in the bathroom. And I was like, what? Why? Like, why, like, is he drunk? And they're like, we have no idea. <laughs> Anyways, ambulance shows, excuse me, ambulance shows up, fire truck shows up. Turns out, because I asked my manager after the dude was brought out on a stretcher, mind you, what happened? Asked my manager. He said, yeah, some guy came up to me and said, hey, there's some dude passed out in the bathroom. I don't know what happened. And my manager could tell, like, he was like, well, if he's, pat like, so, like, you, you you come show me, like, where he is or whatever, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. So they brought him in there, and the guy's like, oh, yeah, he's he's in the in the stall. Yeah. So my manager's just like, okay, obviously, like, you know what's going on because the dude's in the stall. Like, how else would you see it? You know what I mean? Yeah. So my manager looks under, like, the stall door, sees a dude in there like this, needle in his arm. No. Swear to God. Needle in his arm. So my manager goes... No. To the other guy, he goes crawl under there and unlock the door. I, he either did that or he just kicked the door down. The I manager can't did it to another some guest. He's not gonna crawl under there. Wow. So the he, he either I, I forget if the dude actually it. crawled under the door and like opened it or if my manager just okay, like yeah, kicked yeah, down yeah. the door. I don't remember. Anyway, door opens. Um, dude was like out cold, like out cold. Was he tied too before with the? It was like heroin. Oh god. Uh, ambulance came. He's fine. He's alive. But, uh, yeah, ambulance came, took him away, and, um, yeah, that was crazy. That was absolutely crazy. What's I was also there when the, uh, when the Thomas fire hit. Oh, shoot, what was and, that um, like? I mean, it wasn't bad over there, mm -hmm. but, uh, power went out for the whole collection, and Yikes. the building is across the street, and you could see, like, exiting. <laughs> like, have you been there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, if you exit and, like, go out to, like, the back parking lot. With, like, all those apartments over yeah, there, yeah. you could see the flames, like, coming up from, like, behind the, like, apartments. It looked crazy. And then, driving yeah. home from there, power was out all the way to Camarillo. Every city on the way to Camarillo. That, including Camarillo, power was out. That, it was unbelievable. That Thomas fire really just... 
that was absolutely terrible. And and not only did it affect everyone, but it really what it showed me was like how much we take it for granted. I mean, right now we're on a hot day and like dry stuff behind us. This yeah. could be, you know, yeah. um, it's just uh, it's nature scary. can be so powerful. It's scary. All I want to say though, right now is thanks to all the firefighters. And yeah, firemen Seriously. and, and ambulance, emergency responders, everything. All the everyone emergency who volunteered. Responders. I've wanted to donate it. Helicopter, I don't know what the name is, but the helicopters are flying, pour water over the planes just blow water. Pair rescuers. Yeah. I don't think that's what it is. No, that's, that's Air Army. Force. Yeah. I, well, I had an Air Force podcast in my head before. Um, Air Force podcast? Yeah, it was like from guys from the Air Force and like they're talking oh, about yeah? stuff. Oh, yeah? That sounds yeah. cool. Well, I don't know. I want to join like... the Air Force for a little bit. Yeah, you should. You have the haircut, top gun, you got the shades on. You know, people keep saying that to me too. <laughs> really? Like the other day, I was walking behind the bar. To yeah. like give Christian something, yeah, and like this old dude was like, "So you were the uh, you the head marine here?" And I was like, "What?" And he goes, "You the head marine?" I was like, "I don't know what you're talking about." <laughs> the head marine. And he goes, "He's like the haircut. You're in the means, marines, right?" I'm like, "No." <laughs> like I feel bad. I'm like, "No." Should I not have this? Should, should I get? Should I, I get I your haircut? Hair? Should, should I, I grow my no, hair? No, your hair looks good, but should I get my hair like yours too? I don't just know. I just want to shave my head. Why don't you? Because my girlfriend doesn't want me to. <laughs> he, he, honestly, you look a little scary with the shaved head. Then we start thinking like convict or like really old guy, like really like Steve Jobs style. Or like you look like a monk. That's what I'm going for. You want to be a monk? <laughs> no, I'm not going for the monk. You'd be a monk, like a red monk. Red. <laughs> nice red monk. Scorching scun. Scun sun, I mm. mean. This is scalding hot. Good thing I brought, <laughs> good thing I brought some nice hot tea water. <laughs> Oh, um, I could make tea in this. Dude, you, so, the way you just said that, you're like, like, oh, this is scolding hot. I could make tea in this. Like, How am I supposed to describe that? It was so, scolding. Scold, who uses scolding? It's scalding. It's 2018, bro. I'm sorry. I don't even know if that's, what does the, that mean? 28 years too classy. According to you, I'm just a fossil. A fossil? 24, 20, not even you're 24, years 23 older than years old. I'm a, just a fossil. It's too old, dude. I don't know. I'm worried about you, man. I have. You're worried about me. Or you're not going to make it in this world. I'm probably not. I'm kidding. <laughs> Congrats on graduating, by the way. Oh, thanks, dude. That's awesome, man. Thanks, man. Um, it still feels kind of weird. Keep I was expecting that I have, like, papers due and stuff like that. Really? It's weird. Yeah. I just finished a summer class and I, I'm, like, Did freaking you? What out. Class? I just psych. It was, like, a four week psych course. Oh, who'd you have? A Norma Cause. Well, well. Oh, no, Cause I didn't have her. Did you go to Morpar? Yeah, I no had. No way! I had a psych teacher like twice. She was super nice. Super really? Good. Yeah. Check Funny story, actually. I, oh, missed, yeah, go for it. I missed, uh, like I ditched class one day in her uh-huh. psych class. Yeah. And I came back the next day. Yeah. Because I used to ditch that class all the time because I was like, nothing happens. And like, I have an A, so I'm fine. Oh, wow. Came back the next day. She's passing back a test. And I'm like, what? I'm like, maybe, like, what's going on? Oh, like, yeah. <laughs> Is this like a test from like a yeah. long ago? And I, I, one of my class, I think, and I was like, oh, what's this test from? And they were like, last class, and I was like, oh, just completely missed the test, got a zero. Oh, dude. It's fine, I still passed the class. This is why I don't skip classes. Yep, that's, that's why crazy. I skip class all the time. Really? I used to ditch all the time. We would ditch, me and my buddies would ditch and go to Denny's. <laughs> you go to Denny's too? Yeah, so when I was telling you the Denny's story, you weren't kidding. Yeah. You're all like, let's go to Denny's. We would ditch and go to Denny's all the time. We'd be like, uh, do you want to go to class or you want to just go to Denny's? And then we'd come oh back God. from Denny's, and for some unknown reason, they'd always bring golf clubs with them, and then we'd just go to the uh, the uh, <laughs> golf range and just hit golf balls You're and then leave. Savage, dude. Really? Savage. How'd you pass the class? Because more part was in Really? My classes were like, but like a lot of my classes I took were a joke. Really? What about math, though? Are we taking the stats or anything? There. I took oh, okay, yeah. So I took up to Calc two there. Okay, that must have Calc been two tough. got a D. Yeah, that's tough. Calc one got a. All right, we're live. <laughs> Say that again. All right, we're live. In three. Two. Hi, welcome to Nikon Razi podcast number. Oh, this is number part four. Two. Number six, part two. Aside from aside from eating flies and having my camera die. We're still golden. We're still golden, Matt. Feral. Well, I'm gonna be good. red soon, not gold. But, but red. you're in the you're in the cold, man. You're in the shade. Now I'm in the shade, so I'll be fine now. Hopefully, man. I'm gotta sorry protect, about that. Gotta protect this little white boy from the. Dude, sun. 
What's up? Now I remember what I was going to talk about. What? Huge. This what? is, I, I don't know why it's I forgot. Huge? It's huge. What is it? When I first met you, I was like, eh. Yeah? Eh. Yeah? What? Like, 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 like he's nice. Because, cause first of all, the first time you wore He's nice. The first time. But he's such a. When I saw you, you came in and I was uh, hosting, you know, yeah, yeah. filling in menus. You were there like an hour before your oyster bar shift with the other guy because you're getting trained. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he got, he was oh, yeah, there I late. Was a menu he was kind of late. Yeah, you're like, hey, what can I do for you, Nikon? And I was like, oh, you, you can do menus if you want. And I did not think for the life of me that you were going to sit there and like, you did all the menus. That's you just what won sat you over. there. And, well, what, what, what got me, what I didn't know is I thought you were just like faking the niceness, you know, like just like, being, oh, I am. You know, like I didn't know I you were am. like I didn't know still that you were like <laughs> yeah no but I'm serious like I didn't know that you would do that and then after that I was like wow like he's not just being nice like he's genuinely that person there's no face there's no act that really is you know you could have easily have just sat there and had bread or coffee just messed around yeah, well i didn't know Instead, i could have bread or coffee at, at that time oh really so yeah you I were like did. so you're like hey what so should i, I do so and i you... just did menus <laughs> okay but, but in that... my head i was like yeah? man i wish i had bread and coffee right now yeah you could have you could have <laughs> so not have done any of that just but no thanks and um but that's not what i was gonna say i thought you said it was huge this is the part oh this is it i thought this guy's nice but then he's too nice and with nice guys you don't usually have a great love life. Like, he's probably got no girlfriend. You know, maybe that's why he's too nice. One day, one day, it was hot. Happy hour was going, I think. I was don't know. Hot? I don't know where you sat. But he comes in with this <laughs> hot. That sounded <laughs> when I said it like that. But that's hot. Person next to him. And I was like, hey, Matt, who's this? Like, you're friend or something and like it's just like the like 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 10 like just like you came in with a 10 like she's very gorgeous she's very gorgeous and i saw you there and then i was like nope he's nice he's got a legit girl this dude's legit this is a real deal yeah but she'll realize that i'm an idiot sooner or later and dump I, me i wasn't gonna say that on the pod <laughs> i was gonna wait till after that be, no, I, I, sit down I, I, on I'm, me. I'm kidding talk though. to me in the car you Matt, scared listen. me though because you got quiet for a second and i was like oh, because I was like, ha 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 ha, hot, hot, and I was like, what am I saying? And then you're just like staring at me, and I was like, this got awkward right now. I'm like, yeah, Nico? Yeah. Yeah, say more. Yeah. <laughs> what did she say about me? Did she like me? Uh, she said, you're absolutely terrible, and no. Fuck yeah, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> she I'm said you're really nice. No, I mean, she seems like a really nice person, and she no, seems like she really cares about you. super nice. Yeah, no, she's... Which they are, yeah. obviously. <laughs> she, she thinks they're all super nice. <laughs> No, but I mean, like, yeah. It was cool seeing that, because cause normally, like, what I'm trying to say is normally um, guys around 24, 20, whatever, kind of a douche, usually most guys that get cool girls and, and go get, you know, I, I, that's just what I thought, you know? And then I saw that's a guy it. like you, who's not super douchey, really nice, works hard, comes in the restaurant, you know, pays his dues, doesn't take any shortcuts, you know, and just, like, has, like, a cool person uh, in a relationship. I'm not even focusing on the relationship, but I just think that's cool that you do have that. And that, you, I don't know, what I'm trying to say, with, on your I'm, nice. I'm trying to glorify you pretty yeah, much. Yeah, but I don't, I'm not any of those things. And that's why I think you are where you are, because you don't have that sense of like, I'm, you know, I feel like people who think they're too much, I feel like they often don't put the work behind it. And I think because of you're so humble, that's why you've gotten to where you got. Because I feel like, and correct me if I'm wrong, do you often like do something but you never look back and dwell, or, or not dwell, but you never like stop there and say, all right, that was good. I did a good job there. Like, do you always keep saying I can uh, do more? No, I do that with my stuff. Your stuff? Like things for like me. You know okay. I mean? Like school, stuff like okay. that. That's how I always am with that stuff. Because really? I'm, a, I'm a procrastinator. Really? Yeah, bad. With really? like work, and, like not like. Like with like jobs and stuff. Work and stuff. You're with just jobs like, and stuff. Yeah, I, I like put in really the time. good. I put in the time. It's because it's no, like you're really it's work. good. I'm getting paid. Like these people are paying me to do this, so I'm gonna do the job right. You know what I mean? Yeah. But like I don't know stuff like for me. I'm just comparing you to like every other 20 year old guy I've I've met so far in my life, and you just yeah, but you're a 20 year old guy. You're brand new.
Why? Bumblebee! Bumblebee! <laughs> Transformers. They're making another movie. Yeah, it's all about Bumblebee. It's so dumb. I'm dumb with Transformers. Dude. Is it still Michael Bay? No, he's finally out. That's why it's going to happen. Who is it doing I have no idea. Some weird guy. But there's not going to be any explosions. What the hell? <laughs> Michael Bay doesn't even have a storyline. He, he just, just got rid of Megan. He got rid of... He, he added Mark Wahlberg for two movies. He took him out. Hey. Hey, I'm Mark Wahlberg. I'm in Transformers now. <laughs> Ted. I love Ted, dude. Ted, Ted is so funny. I haven't seen Ted 2, though. Ted 2 is not as, not as funny. Yeah. Um, have you seen Daddy's Home? I have seen Daddy's Home. Those are good. I haven't. I oh. my parents saw. I saw it the and second I one um, on my on my on the plane. Mel Gibson was in it. I was actually seeing Ted one um, on an Amtrak train with my older cousin. We got these big Ralph sandwiches you could get. I don't know if you've ever yeah. seen them. Yeah. They're so good. Just bread, cheese, turkey, just fat, huge. Have you ever been? What what states have you been to? Have you been to New Jersey? No. Okay. There's a place in New Jersey. Me and Bree were talking about this the other day. It's uh, called Wawa. Wawa. The best ever. I'm being serious. Yeah. The best ever. It's basically a 7-Eleven. <laughs> I think I've heard of Wawa. Times Wawa's. 100. Don't they have it in other places other than no, New Jersey? it's only oh, Jersey. Okay. Jersey and then I think uh, parts of uh, Pennsylvania. Wawa's. I've heard something about that. Wow. It's like a 7-Eleven. It's usually attached to like a gas station or something like yeah. that. You walk in, you order like on a screen. It's all sandwiches. Wow. But these sandwiches yeah. are unbelievable. They make Subway. They're not Subway level. They make Subway look like if you're eating at Subway, you're basically eating out of a dumpster, which you kind of are anyway because Subway, Subway already sucks. Subway just – I haven't had a meatball used, marinara. Subway used to be good, but then – I don't know. I, I, I went – Well, there was a big hype with Subway. Yeah, there was, time. and then I and then I and the started guy, to and I that guy to, the, that 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 guy who yeah, lost well, weight and then something happened with him. Do you know what happened? He with him? had a ton of child pornography in his house. That's what it was. He did something dark where they took yeah, him out. Yeah, he had a ton of child pornography in his house. Because <laughs> he was yeah. big and he was holding his pants. Very, Look how much weight I lost. Very bad. Yeah, oh, that's dark. Yeah, it's something yeah. dark. But I, I I was eating it somewhere and then I I started noticing like just like a quality decline in quality. Maybe and it was up. The but Shal- Have you ever been to uh, not Shalas? Excuse me. What was the name? There's another one that Chris knows. Is good. Um, it's an Italian place. Jersey, Jersey Mike's. Mike's. That's what Jersey I was Mike's is bomb. They have yeah. some like oil and stuff. They just no, have no, flavor. No. All like, those places, literally, all of them. Right, compared to yeah. compared to Wawa, you're eating out of. A well, I mean, New Jersey is known. I'm pretty sure they're known for some kind of like. Uh, you think? Oh of my Philly. god! Oh, that's Philly, Philly cheesesteak. Cheese yeah, you're thinking Philly. Philly cheesesteak. Um, well, still damn thing. Cheesesteak. Wawa is unbelievable. Damn. We can go there. And right it's now. cheap as hell too. Really? Yeah. And we don't, you know, the only good spots here in California, I feel like, are places in LA. There's all these crazy. Food. There's all these crazy, yeah, like the really, aside from well, the little fish house. There's a lot of stuff actually in Northridge. Northridge is up there because Northridge That's has true. a lot of like ethnic places That's that are, have really good food. That's true. But around Camarillo. Camarillo's got nothing. Besides Lord Thousand fish Oaks. House. Besides for Lure Fish House. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean, Lure killed it here, and there's a reason oh why they killed it. Oh, my God. Quality and also seafood, because everything else was one or two yeah, red lobsters but not even around. here. Think about it. They went to Santa Barbara, and Santa Barbara's inundated with fish places. That's true. And Lure still kills it over there. That's true. It's just a good model. It is. It's a really good business model. It really is. Like, Even when I tell people that I work there, like, there's a huge amount of respect out there. There is. There just is. There really is. It's just a thing. It's the fact. It's prestigious. It is what it is. I'm really hungry. Are you cool if we end it? Yeah, I'm cool. Okay. Oh, I need I'll a let shout out. I'll let you do this. I'll, I'll link uh, Matt's Instagram under here. And uh, Matt, do you want me to link your Facebook? Um, I don't have Facebook. Your um, I'm MySpace. Off, I'm off the grid. Oh, you don't have Instagram either. I forgot. No, I do have an Instagram. I, I do. Just don't all right. have Facebook. I'll put your stuff down. I'll put my stuff down. Any shout outs you'd like to give to all my uh, fans out there? Uh, All the listeners. Thanks for watching Nikon. He's the man. That's that sounds pl- That sounds what? It sounds like planned out. Like I told you to say that. He paid me twenty bucks to say that. Can I have my wallet back, by the way. I have to get the twenty bucks out of there. All right. What if there's only five in there and twenty still in my house? Well, then you're buying me lunch. Sounds good. And, I'm and with get that, six dozen wings. And with that, did you see that white bar that's jumping? That's yeah, my that? voice. Now you talk. Now I'm talking. And I only got about halfway up. And then Even I'm like, there, is, look at me, dude. I think Get on my, my voice l- is 
deeper. My voice is just loud. I think my voice is deeper. Yeah, it's so sure it'll it register. Maybe smoother. Probably not. Smoother. It'll just when hit, you play it it'll back, hit all the girls and their in their ears. They'll happen. be like, oh my god. That'll definitely not happen. This oh my god, it's such a you'll strong play, guy. You'll play the yeah the podcast back. Yeah. I'll be talking too quiet the whole time. Uh-huh. Where you can't hear anything that I'm saying, so uh-huh. it's pretty much just you talking. Uh-huh. To me and yeah. me not talking back to you, mm-hmm. and you'll just have to delete the whole podcast, and then you'll be really upset. I think this is the one podcast where I had a good amount of you talking because all my other podcasts, I would just skim through them to listen to them, and I would just see me again, me again, and then one second of my other guests going, and then and just me the whole way. I gotta stop doing that. That's all right. Oh, it's, I think uh, the other reason why I really like doing podcasts is because I want to give out a message to any. Anyone really is listening? Do you have anything like inspirational you want to give, or something motivational, just to say something about like I don't know? Like who? Who? To who? To anyone? You go first. I'll go, I'll go first. Off you. Yeah. So I think it's really important to surround yourself with like. Every time I talk, I just feel like I'm just taking words I took from someone else. So I'm not gonna go there. But I think it's important to stay positive, hang out with people that are kind of also positive. I think that who you hang around with and spend most of your time with has somewhat of a big effect on you. Um, I definitely think like that old saying, like you are where your friends are, is kind of a good thing. Like if you're surrounded by people that lie and don't really, you know, they kind of half everything and they don't really go every do everything the right way. I feel like you're gonna kind of get affected by that. Whereas opposed to if you hang out with people that are really hardworking, honest, some of those qualities might rub off on you. Um, so yeah, try to just make sure that. Whoever's around you is good, but also, you know, don't put all your uh, problems out and think that uh, can't talk today. You're accountable for yourself. Have accountability for everything that you do. Don't blame other people and understand that, like, you are, you know, the saying. There's another saying, like, <laughs> another saying that goes, you know, you are the author of your own, your own life, your own book. Like, you have the pen. So, like, yeah, you can't change every situation that might happen to you like there might be a plane flying above you but like just make do with what you have and just you know keep doing whatever it is you love to do and um and understand that like if you want something go and do it work hard for it a little bit just work for the stuff you want in life yeah that was really good there you go dude that seriously was, that was really good well i it's all i do i don't know if i have anything to yeah, add to you that do. that was like that was that covered everything. Oh, get out of here, dude. You're too humble. Yeah, you're very motivational. You're so hum- I'm, I'm motivation. I I'm hungry speak. right you're now. You're motivational. That's why I'm motivational. Well, let's go. <laughs> I'm going to have to duck that out. Duck it out? Duh, oh, duh, the duh, quack, duh, quack. Duh, duh, quack, quack. Duh, 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 duck, 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 I might use another drone shot for the outro. The one just goes off. No, but like, do you say anything for like the outro? No, you like. I haven't said. And we're out. Should say that. Like, like how fire in the like how Brandon Shop goes like. Yeah, I need to have something like that. I don't. I have to. I need to get like a song. It's that's like a one of those songs from like. I don't think Chris D'Elia does anything. Well, he just has himself too. But like, also look up Chris D'Elia. Incorrigible Netflix. It's hilarious. I don't know any why. Other I don't know why. Any other why I'm plugging Chris D'Elia. <laughs> not I'm even not yourself. Paid not your this. girlfriend. Not your mom. Not your dad. No, shout out Nicole. Shout out to Nicole for being the best. Who's really ha 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 yeah, no, that was good. I think I think we kind of covered everything. We covered it. We had everything. Didn't talk about sports though. Damn. Oh shoot, you're an Eagles. Oh, we don't so need World to talk Cup? About sports. I don't. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm not into. But a World Cup, I know, like my team, but Who's not going team? Iran. Oh yeah, Iran. But we. St- 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 is that st- how you say it? Stop. No, it's Iran. Iran. Iran's good. Iran. What I don't like is Iran. Iran. I Oh, shit, that's what I hate hearing Iran. It, I everyone say Iran. says it. It's yeah. like even Mexico. You're supposed to say Mexico, right? So I don't take it personally because everyone says no, everyone's. I think you're fine saying Mexico. I think. I don't I'm know. pretty I sure it's Mexico. Like Iraq or yeah, but then I sound oh, like a... Afghanistan. You're not supposed to say Afghanistan. It's Afghanistan. Yeah, but then I sound like a <laughs> if I say Mexico. You know what I mean? <laughs> I like I sound like. A... Say Iran like the way I would say like Iran. Iran? No, that doesn't sound that bad. Say Iran. But like if I say 
I'm not gonna Iran. I'm, that's how we say it. Talk like that. Obviously, say it like, no, that. I'm not gonna say say, like that. Please, Obviously, that's I'm not how say we say, say, it. Like that. Obviously not say it. We've said like everything that. else. Obviously not saying it like that. Please. No. We'll end it with that. Say it. No. Iran. Just try it. End it with you saying it like that. No, you saying it. And me. Please. Please. Saying normal. No, please. No. Just say Iran. Iran. And we're out. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna end it. Quote of the day. Okay. Me saying it wrong. <laughs> oh, it wasn't recording, can you imagine?